Hi everybody, um, my name is Samantha if you don't know me. Um, I promised you a, another thrift haul. This actually is my biggest haul of my entire life when it comes to thrifting. So this is really exciting and this is also the first time that I went full out into the men's section and I am surprised I found a lot of amazing pieces. So I ended up spending about $180, the most I've ever spent at a thrift store, but I definitely got some amazing pieces. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do from like the lowest price used items to the highest price, then I'm gonna do the lowest price new of tag items to the highest price. So this went down to $1.50 in the men's section. It's Marmot, really expensive brand. I would keep this, but I actually have something just like it. It was $1.99. Look at how beautiful this print is. So this is like a bandana. Um, what I'm gonna do is just like keep doing this. This could be like possibly like a headband. Let's see. I'm not doing this well. I'm just trying to give you an idea. And then you can make it like a little bit of a triangle shape and do that. So this is gonna be end up being two dollars. Your basic men's blue shirt from Adidas. This ended up being two fifty. This might be a little crazy. It has a shoulder pad, so it's vintage. But look at how pretty this is. I mostly I don't like polka dot, but with this, like, look at this print. It's just like the bandana and like a paisley print. Oh my gosh, I love it. It's a size 16, surprisingly, from Alfred Dunner. I've heard that brand before, but um, this is awesome. So this was in the men's section. Just a big Tommy Hilfiger logo. $2.99 for this. And I should mention that um, the white price, the white colored tags were full price because they were in their first week, but all the other tags are 50% off. So I'm gonna tell you just basically like what price it ended up being after the discount. Normally I don't support Forever 21, but look at this sleeve. Is that not beautiful? I love that Aztec tribal style. So it's a cardigan, $2.99. First week goes there. So that's definitely gonna be for me. This is awesome. I don't even know how to describe this. It's absolutely beautiful. I don't know, it's like working on the railroad or something crazy. Something crazy awesome, $4.99. This is also $4.99. Casual corner. It's like a vintage, this is probably like year 2000 if I had to guess, because there's no shoulder pads. But I thought that this would be perfect with black leggings, because it's like the perfect tunic length. Another thing for me. It has shoulder pads in it, it is brand. Norm Thompson, really good quality. I love this material. Let me hold it up in person, it doesn't do this justice. It's nice and long. This ended up being four bucks. It's a size large Tommy Hilfiger, but it fits more like a medium. I mostly like it because um the embroidery, so you can tell it's Tommy Hilfiger if you ever shop Tommy Hilfiger. Just a nice men's, possibly men's I'm assuming, because that's where it was pullover. This is Eddie Bauer. It's a perfect fit though because it's actually a medium. I love the stripe. It kind of reminds me of like Tommy Hilfiger a little bit because um it's blue and white and red. But I just thought it'd be perfect to wear with leggings. It's a perfect length to do that. This is something I'm actually gonna sell. I did look up comps after. I never find anthropology and if I do it's like really bad quality that's used too late. I don't even know how to pronounce it. This is too girly for me. But when I put it on, I was surprised that I liked it a lot more. All right, now let's go to the new of tag items. So this is Talbots. I'm surprised this was only $22 brand new. It ended up going down to $2.50. I only own one blue turtleneck. And this is a this one is just like barely a turtleneck. Most turtlenecks are just so constricting. And this isn't, so I love it. So this is going down to $2.50. It is men's, it's called Method size extra large so this is something that I would tuck into just your jeans 
I love a forest green color. And even though I say I'm keeping like the majority of this stuff, um, I would still sell it if somebody wanted it. This is American Eagle Outfitters. Oh, just a fun fact. American Eagle, Airy, Gap, Old Navy, and Banana Republic on their um, material measurement tag at, underneath it. They put the date of how old this is. So surprisingly, this is from 2011. It doesn't look like an old style though. I love this aztec -y. It reminds me of, I love this store. You have to check it out. It's called Earthbound Trading Company. And then that American Eagle shirt went down to four bucks. This one's down to four bucks. I found this also in um, very similar style in like a light blue and a dark blue, but I only ended up picking up one because you know, you don't want to get too many of this the same thing. The brand is LD Sport, extra large, men's. And I picked this one up specifically because of the bottom. These oversized stuff looks just so great, tucked in the jeans. And then I'll be going down the five bucks. American Eagle, cardigan, very simple. Women's, to the point. This is a boutique brand that you might see a lot of people on Poshmark sell, um, G USA. Went down to five bucks. I don't normally wear orange, but this is very fall, autumn, beautiful. Nice sleeve. This went down to seven fifty, so a little bit more expensive. It's this um, I don't even know how to pronounce that. Caslin. It was from Nordstrom, so that's probably why they upped it. This reminds me of an equestrian style, and I love the equestrian style because um, of the side partial side button detail. So then if I unbutton this, you know, it'll look great with leggings, black leggings. This was kind of out there. So I paid $8 for this and it's a size 3X men's. So here's my idea. So I went to RMU. It's an Under Armour RMU, very thin hooded, like, you know, hoodie. And what I'm going to do, because it's so long on me, it looks like a dress. This will be perfect with leggings. And I just think I c it has potential. This is the one that I was probably most hesitant to buy. It went down to $10. It was um, club room, size large. But at the end of the day, I liked it. It sparked joy. I like stripes. I can make this work as like an equestrian style with riding boots and dark wash jeans. Tuck it in. All these stuff are like so oversized, so I have to tuck it in. Finally found a Tommy Hilfiger. A little expensive. Went down to $12.50. This is more of like a dark olive green, has a Tommy logo. Another thing to knot in the front and tuck in the jeans. These are my probably my three favorite besides a scarf. Look at how beautiful. Very nautical style with the, it's hard to see, but um, has an anchor on it. Now this will look great with my Sperry boots. I had the $98 price tag on it and it went down to $12.50. So I love that. This is a two-piece set, so I'm gonna show you each of them. I only tried the blazer on it, it fits me perfectly. It was a two-piece set. You're not gonna believe the price tag on this. $380. Guess how much I paid for it? Half off of 30 bucks, $15. Oh, here's a better way to find the brand. That's what it looks like for future reference, guys. Very basic. I don't have any cream pants or anything like this, like with blazer or pants. That'll be great for a professional thing. The pants were stained though at the bottom, even though it was new of tag, so I have to get them dry clean if I'm gonna keep it. I think somebody just probably dragged it on the ground, didn't hang it high enough. This was my most expensive find. It went down to $30. It was, they had it marked for 60 bucks, so if I didn't go on Wednesday half off day, that would have been insane. I'm so excited for this equipment. It has the $208 price tag. This is like a beautiful color, seriously. Just your basic long sleeve blouse. I just love, love, love this color. They put this behind like the cashiers. So I, I knew this was here a couple weeks ago and I asked them if they could do a lower price. Like could they do like half off of 20? And the manager came up and he's like, Heck no, like we're just gonna, it goes to a different place that's like more designer after it doesn't sell. So I should have asked like, hey, can you at least do like half off of 50? Because then he maybe would have considered it. But 
I really can't complain because like I mean I used to buy like brand new American Eagle shirts for like 30 bucks and think that was a deal so I can't complain all right so this is lucky by the way if you didn't see him in the last video <laughs> his birthday's in a couple days he's gonna be 16 he's our little cuddle baby but um thank you very much for watching and if there's anything in the future you want to see you know let me know and I hope to see you in my next video all right thank you bye